Happy birthday to Ice Cube's son, O'Shea Jackson Jr. It's your boy, X-Man1991. I'm back again with another sports topic. This video rant is sponsored by Arizona Ice Tea. I got four games to do a recap on. First game we're going to do a recap on is last night's game between the Charlotte Hornets and the Golden State Warriors. The Warriors dominated the first half, outscoring the Hornets in the first quarter 22 to 15. Then they outscored them in the second quarter 21 to 14. At halftime, Warriors 42, Hornets 29. The Warriors outscored the Hornets by seven in the third quarter, 30 to 23. After the third quarter, Warriors 73, Hornets 52. The Hornets outscored the Warriors by eight in the fourth quarter, 32 to 24. Final score, Golden State Warriors 97, Charlotte Hornets 84. The Warriors are now 29 and 26 as the Hornets fall to 14 and 42. Tomorrow night, the Warriors takes on the defending NBA champs, the Denver Chicken Nuggets. You all know who's the player of the game, Steph Curry. 15 points, two rebounds and five assists. Nick Richards needed nine more assists to go with a triple-double. 11 points, 13 rebounds, and nine, one assists. Miles Bridges needed seven more assists to go with a triple-double. 19 points, 11 rebounds, and three assists. Next up, the Miami Heat versus the New Orleans Pelicans. The Heat dominated the first half, outscoring the Hornets by No, they didn't dominate him in the first half, just the first quarter, by 7, 31 to 24. Then they lost by 7 in the second quarter, 34 to 27. At halftime, both uh, the score was tied at 58. The Heat dominated the second half, outscoring the, the Pelicans by four in the third quarter, 26 to 22. After three, Heat 84, Pelicans 80. The Heat outscored the Pelicans in the fourth quarter, 22 to 15. Final score. Miami Heat, 106, New Orleans Pelicans, 95. The Heat are now 31 and 25 as the Pelicans fall to 34 and 23. The Heat next game is on Monday against the Kings in Sacramento. The player of the game was Bam Adebayo, 24 points, seven rebounds and one assist. Jonas Valanciunas needed 10 assists to go with a triple-double, 12 points and 10 rebounds. I will show you the nasty-ass brawl that happened between the Heat and the Pelicans during the fourth quarter in a minute. But we got two more games to do a recap on, and that is the San Antonio Spurs and the LA Lakers. Lakers dominated the first half, outscoring the Spurs by six in the first quarter, 30 to 26. Then they outscored them by three in the second quarter, 36 to 33. At halftime, Lakers 66, Heat or Spurs 59. Both teams scored 31 points apiece in the third quarter. After three, 
Lakers 97, Spurs 90. Lakers lost by Deuce in the fourth quarter, 28-26. Final score, Los Angeles Lakers 123, San Antonio Spurs 118. The Lakers are now 31 and 27 as the Spurs drop to 11 and 46. Tomorrow, the Lakers will go against the Suns in Phoenix. The rookie of the Spurs, Victor Wambiyama, needed two more assists to go with a triple double 27 points, 10 rebounds, and 8 assists. Jeremy Sockhan needed five more assists to go with a triple double. 15 points, 13 rebounds, and 5 assists. But you all should know who's the player of the game. LeBron James. 30 points, 7 rebounds, and 9 assists. Anthony Davis needed 10 assists to go with a triple-double. 28 points and 13 rebounds. And now, the last game to do a recap on. The Phoenix Suns and my Houston Rockets. The Rockets lost by 8 in the first quarter, 28-20, but they made a comeback in the second quarter by 7, 37-24. At halftime, Rockets 59 or Rockets 57, Suns 52. Rockets outscored the Suns by 8 in the third quarter, 32 to 24. After the third quarter, Rockets 89, Suns 76. Rockets lost by 9 in the fourth quarter, 20, 34 to 25. Final score. Houston Rockets 114, Phoenix Suns 110. The Rockets are now 25 and 31 as the Suns drop to 33 and 24. The Rockets will take on the Thunder tomorrow night. KD needed two more assists to go with a triple double 28 points, 11 rebounds, and 8 assists. Boy Boy needed 10 assists to go with a triple double 25 points, and 14 rebounds. Jabari Smith Jr. needed seven more assists to go with a triple-double. 22 points, 16 rebounds, and three assists. Alperin Sungun needed six more assists to go with a triple-double. 17 points, 12 rebounds, and four assists. And Amin Thompson needed eight more assists to go with a triple-double. 15 points, 10 rebounds, and two assists. But the player of the game who just came back from an injury... Fred Van Vliet, 23 points, 5 rebounds, and 5 assists. Yeah, man. Congrats to all four of my teams for getting the job done. The Warriors, the Rockets, the Lakers, and the Heat. Congrats to all four of them. They all got the job done. But now it's time for me to show you all this brawl that happened last night between the Heat and the Pelicans during the fourth quarter. Oh, my God. And I will let you know which five players got tossed during this game. Oh, my goodness. Okay, here we go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, 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 shit. Here we go. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Uh oh. They gone Mazern at the Mardi Gras. Sorry about that. And then what happens here with Jose Alvarado and Thomas Bryant, they're sitting here and they're talking to each other. And Joe, I'm sitting here and I'm looking right at it. And I thought that sometimes when things happen, you have two dudes that know each other right. prior to. And then I thought that they were just joking with each other. And then I see those two swinging at each other. Wow. There you have it. Thomas Bryant's Kevin Love, Jimmy Butler, Najee Marshall, and Jose Alvarado all got tossed. I don't know what the hell you guys were thinking, but this is no time to be picking a fight. Unbelievable. But it was funny at the same time. So that was my response to Mike Henry. He showed that brawl in his rant. Now I'm showing that brawl to y'all on my rant. Because y'all need to get y'all shit together. I hope none of y'all don't get suspended after that crazy brawl. Speaking of Mike Henry, shout out to him, Jamie and Katie Feiler, the hosts of the Just a Little Shady podcast, Haley J to Brittany, and Samurai Red the X-Files. A link to their pages will be in the description down below.
That's going to do it for my recap of last night's game between the Hornets and the Warriors, the Suns and the Rockets, the Spurs and the Lakers, and the Heat and the Pelicans. If you're new here, hit subscribe, hit that notification bell for my next Lakers, Rockets, Heat, and Warriors rant. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment down below. If I have time, I might come back for another video. If not, then tomorrow I'll show you all highlights of the 2001 WWF No Way Out pay-per-view. Until then, go Golden State Warriors. Go Miami Heat. Go Los Angeles Lakers. And go Houston Rockets. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. No more talk.